Hello, Mark Satterfield here. Thanks so much for joining me. Got a couple of interesting things for you today. The first focuses on building relationships with affluent customers and clients. And actually, this came about from a trip that Marion and I took last week uh, to, uh, to Boston to, uh, to visit my uh, old prep school, Buckingham, Brown and Nichols. And of course, development officers are very focused on building relationships with the affluent. And interestingly, some of their strategies, what they're doing, I think are applicable for anyone who's targeting the affluent marketplace. And I share those strategies with you in the first article. So uh, if you're marketing to the affluent community, please check that out. Second of all, I've got an interesting article for you that I think will be of most benefit for those of you that already have a marketing system, a marketing funnel up and running. It's, it's a rather advanced strategy, but it's highly effective. And what it focuses on is how do we re-engage clients? You know, we can have a huge list, but if only a teeny tiny percentage of that list is actually reading our messages, all that huge number is doing is kind of clogging up our email system. So before you just arbitrarily get rid of all those people, you might want to consider implementing a re-engagement series. And in the second article, I describe what that is. I actually give you the templates for implementing it. So if you've got a marketing system up and running, you've already got your funnel, this is an advanced strategy to get prospects to re-engage with you, those that haven't perhaps clicked on a link, uh, link for 30, 45, 60 days. And I outline all of that in the, in the second article. Uh, finally, I've got an interesting resource uh, for you today. Uh, it is immediately to the, the right of this, uh, this video, and it's the directory of sales and marketing letters that's specifically written for financial advisors and insurance producers who are targeting the affluent. So it kind of ties into our theme of the, of the first article. So if you're a financial advisor, if you're going after accredited investors, ultra high net worth, uh, uh, prospects, I think you're going to find that directory of sales and marketing letters to be very, very helpful, uh, both in terms of old school, you know, actually sending by somebody a letter which you put a stamp on the envelope, as well as in your in your emails. So, uh, so check that out if uh, if that's a market you're going after. So again, really good stuff for you today. And as always, thanks so much for being a part of my community. And drop me a note if there's particular topics you want me to focus on in the future. So until this time next week, this is Mark Satterfield. Bye for now.